everybody. We decided this weekend to uh, head down to South Carolina and take a look at a couple of campers. And uh, the sales guy actually showed us this one just to give you guys an idea of what it runs. And it's a 39P Forest River. And the quote we were given was pretty close to, you know, the sale price they have on it. This is a 2015. Um, here is the little entertainment center which is pretty cool. It's got fake stonework up there and then this really nice slide fireplace, or I'm sorry, <laughs> sliding glass door. And then here are the uh, bunk rooms. And this is really cool in comparison to the one we've been looking at before because you've got this great drawer storage area underneath. Um, this one's really nice too. This is actually a park model, so it has higher ceilings in it, but you have a lot more storage in these, three high. And then uh, let's come around here. We've got more storage area. Some storage area above the little dinette. This obviously folds down into a bed like a lot of the other ones do. And then here is the main kind of living area. Just to give you an idea, the entertainment center is behind me. And then this is the kitchen. And the difference with the park model, I guess, from what the sales guy was telling us, is it's actually more set up for kind of what we're doing long-term living. He said the roofs, um, the roof on these last about 15 years, full-size fridge. And then you can also get them uh, set up with washing machine and dryer. This is a great bathroom. You're actually in the bathroom right now. And then they have separate doors. Um, here's the washing machine and dryer, but they actually have the toilet is back here. So you're kind of in the bathroom and then it opens up where it has the toilet room. And so this walks through, I'll back up here again just so you guys can get an idea of where I'm going here. I'm in the kitchen and then you walk through to the master bedroom. And this has a queen back here. And I guess underneath this bed, there's a lot of storage space you can access from the outside. It's got a door here. And you can't really tell in the video, but there's actually quite a bit of walking room around the bed here. So, kind of nice. Lots of storage. Um, but anyway, this is the camper that we're looking at right now. And one of the things he had mentioned is you really want to get two AC units in here. So that'll run you about an extra 900 and then it's about 1800 to get it set up with the Euro washer and dryer. So, anyway, there you guys have it.